introduction yeah, here. We're the Ready Set Autism Family. My name is Chris. I'm Dad. And then this is Malia. Yeah. This vlog is going to be all about Malia. She's nine years old and she has nonverbal autism. And she's very happy most of the time except when she's hungry or tired, which she's tired right now. Um, and then go ahead. She also has celiac disease, so sometimes her fits her over food because she can't have any kind of gluten in it. I'm Amanda, and I'm also a mom. Who are you? Hi, buddy. Here, put your name. I play with my sister so she can have fun. And Aubrey is seven. And then this is Isaac, and he's two, almost three. I mean, like, probably like 34 months old or something like that, right? Yeah. <laughs> the end of September. And he's also tired, so he's doing really crazy things right now. And As you see, um, doing his own thing right now. And we want to say thanks for watching. And we have a lot more to upload and uh, plenty of footage to see from Malia. So, Malia. Look. Malia. <laughs> Malia. Malia, say bye. Say bye. Bye, bye everybody. Bye, bye. Isaac, come here. Bye, Daddy. No, no, say bye to the camera. Say bye. Bye, bye Daddy. Bye. Bye, bye Mommy. Ready? One, two, bye. three. Bye. Good job. Good job. So we're coming in today live from Phantom Fireworks. I don't know. And Malia is not happy about this storm. Isaac. Right, Malia? Isaac, we, oh, are you Isaac? She wants to go in. So we're live here at Phantom Fireworks. What? Again. <laughs> Again, we're live here at Phantom Fireworks, and it's storming out here. With the amount of people showing up, the entire parking lot is full, and they even got the police hiding over there. Dad, what is this place? They sell kaboomers here. What's kaboomers? They're fireworks. It's a big, massive store of fireworks, and there's a line to get in because everybody's here. Cause they want to All right, celebrate. ready, everybody? One, two, three. Happy Fourth of July! Happy Fourth of July! Cool, okay. Yeah. So we're in Phantom Fireworks and it's cramped and there's like no air conditioning in here. It's really hot. And she hates small spaces with a lot of people. So this is not the place for her. And we're on a budget here. So we're just getting things that the kids would like and things that won't disturb the neighbors and, you know, have stuff on their roofs when they wake up. Come on, let's go see him. Give me your hand. Come on, let's go. Do you like Tucky G's? It's okay, Malia. It's just Chucky. Come here. Malia, it's just Chucky e. Cheese. It's okay. Okay? He's just gonna throw some tickets at you. Don't run off. You're okay. <laughs> Isaac, did you get a lot of tickets? You got tickets from Chuck E. Cheese. Malia. Six, Malia. Eight. 
Hi, did you like Chucky? He's gone now, you don't have to worry, he's gone. He's not gonna surprise attack you. It's okay, oh, it's okay. It's okay, he's gone, Malia. He left. Chucky's nice. He just throws tickets at people and dances. See? I got tickets. Do you want pizza, buddy? Do you want pizza? Yeah? Here at Chucky Cheese, and Malia just got to see Chucky up close and personal, and she does not like him. Right now, for the past couple minutes since he's been going, she's been searching for him, and uh, not good. Uh, so we're trying to calm her down right now because she's just focused on finding where he's at. So that's what she does when she's really aggravated and annoyed. And right now, the aggravation stemmed by Chucky. Even though he's been gone for five minutes, she's really upset with him. And she's upset with anybody who is similar to Chucky, if you know what I mean. So Amanda's doing what you call compressions. They're like little massages up and down the arms up to the shoulders and that actually does help her calm down so we're hoping that she's starting to smile and laugh now and then this guy is just losing his mind <laughs> literally like he just can't stay still he's standing up on the table he's slapping us headbutting us just too excited Isaac, what are you doing? Isaac, I'm not going anywhere. Anytime I sit up just for a second, he's like out the booth and ready to go. But we're waiting for our food. Yeah. 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 She's still looking for Chucky. <laughs> What's going on in there? Uh, it's really crazy. It looks like a crazy bus. <laughs> He's not even steering. So Malia's calmed down since Chucky went away, kind of back to herself. She's actually wandering around like a crazy woman. Sorry about the lighting there. I'm just letting her wander, which we sometimes don't do, because she is somewhat unpredictable. So you don't know if she's gonna like grab someone's drink off someone's table or run for the door. Malia! Malia! And sometimes she just gets too involved in what she's doing to even hear you. Malia! My, no, no. And because of sensory, she likes to put a lot of things to her mouth. Some things you just don't want to do that with, like that thing. And now she's hugging that thing because that's all about sensory right there. All right, I'm going to try to get her to go somewhere else. Brothers pulling cars off of the table. One, two, three. <laughs> I told you. Now he's laughing. Aubrey, they have a question for you. What? 
What do you do to make your hair so fluffy? I wear it up. They said thanks. Malia, did you eat your rice? Yes. <laughs> Do you need more drink? <laughs> You're silly. Sister has been attacking everybody for rice. And she ate all her rice, you can see. And I wonder if there are any questions coming in. <laughs> I'm playing the violin. Looks like little mama bear wants to know, do you play a musical instrument? I play the guitar. And I have a toy by it. No, I have a toy, um, what's it called? Mom. Ukulele. A ukulele. It's a, but I know how to play the guitar. And I'm on YouTube too. Oh, what's your channel name? Little Luke Fan. Cool. I might change it. So. Okay. How many people are watching us? It says 12. 12? Somebody told us? What? Somebody told us? Told us what? That there is. No, it, it has a counter. Oh, that's a lot of people. They want to know if you play with your sister. I play with my sister in the playroom. 32 viewers. Or in my room. Mm. Or in her room. What games do you play? I play, um, have you guys ever heard of? My sister. Oh, um, we, play, we used to play Candyland with my mom and me and her. We do play on the computer sometimes. Or when I had a tablet, we would lay down, like on my bed and this watch. And one of my brother wants to play with us, and we go to my room and hang out as my mom's like cooking lunch or something, or watching TV. Let's go in my room. 62 viewers. <laughs> All right, we're ending Fourth of July night with a special patriarch dessert made homemade by mommy. She was out here whipping all night to make this dessert, and here it is. Ooh. Yummy custom homemade whipped cream with Ghirardelli chocolate brownies with nice silver forks. Except this one right here, if you look close, that is a gluten-free donut for Malia because she can't have anything with gluten in it. Nothing like eating the top layer of a donut. Malia. Malia, is that good? some fireworks we didn't buy anything too large because all the kids are so little but we got this one mega pack here it's 25 shots all right here we go where's that fuse you ready all right here we go guys get ready Was that? Huh? I know, it's really good. 
feels like it's gonna come down on you, right? Malia, Malia, did you like that? Malia. Hey, thanks for watching our video. If you want to learn more about autism and everyday life with autism, please remember to like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.